we are going to talk about the Caprica constant, which is an important constant in mathematics. So let's see how it works. First, we choose a number. Uh, we decide to choose a number such that it is in descending order, the biggest number followed by the smallest number at the end. The next step you're going to do, you are going to minus the reverse, okay? So you take the smallest to the biggest. Put in your calculator and the answer is going to come up to 8172. So next step, you have to rearrange this number such that it becomes from biggest to the smaller. So 8172 becomes 8721. And you're going to minus the reverse, the smaller to the bigger. So minus 1, 2, 7, 8. And put in your calculator, it's going to be 7, 4, 4, 3. Do the steps again. 7, 4, 4, 3 is in order from bigger to smaller. So you don't have to do anything. So 7, 4, 4, 3 remain. You're going to minus the reverse, which is the smaller to the bigger. So 3, 4, 4, 7. And put in your calculator, it's going to get 3, 9, 9, 6. Now, you have to rearrange the number again. 3996 becomes 9963 from bigger to smaller. Then you're going to minus the reverse, 3699, and you get 6264. What you do now? The next step, you're going to do the same thing again. Make the biggest number, so 6642, so 6642, and you're going to minus the reverse, 2466, smaller to bigger, and you're going to get 4176. Last but not least, 4176, you arrange from bigger to smaller, it's going to be 7641, and you minus from smaller to bigger, it's 1467. And you're going to get 6174, that is the Caprica constant. If you rearrange 6174, it's going to be 7641 again, and this will always end with 6174. So try another number and tell me whether it works. Okay, the Caprica constant for a three-digit number, you don't like to do the four-digit number, you can also do the three-digit number, the number is 495. Suppose we choose the number 592. First step, you need to arrange from bigger to smaller, the number becomes 952. Then you're going to minus the reverse of this, or the smaller to bigger, so minus 259, and you get 693. Then the next step, you're going to rearrange this number from bigger to smaller, become 963, and you minus the reverse 369, which is the smaller to bigger. And the answer is going to be 594. Next, you are going to rearrange this, become 954, because bigger to smaller, 954, and then you're going to minus the reverse 459, or smaller to bigger, and you're going to get 495. So if you rearrange this number, it's going to be again, you're going to get 954, which is going to be a loop. So you will get the same answer again and again. So this is called a Caprica constant. Have a go at another number and see whether it works. It should work because this is done by Caprica, who is a well-renowned mathematician in the world. And the other special number that I want to mention is 3435. This is called the Munchausen number because that is the only number in math where you cube it. So three cube, you take the cube of the same number, three cube plus four to the power of four, plus 3 to the power 3, plus 5 to the power 5, will give you back the number 3,435. So that is interesting numbers for today. Cheers, everyone.